Hi guys and welcome back to Kama Crypto. Here we are going to wrap up how the market turned out in the last 24 hours. So Bitcoin and Ether were both gaining in today in trading in Asia as well as many other top 10 cryptocurrencies by market cap. But stable coins weren't performing up to the market. So some of the US equities finished last week higher in their biggest days of gains since June. So rounding it up, Bitcoin rose about more than 2% in the last 24 hours while Ether gained by more than 4.3%. Solana also posted strong gains with uh, more than 4.6% along with Cardona with a good range of 2.7%. So these four coins, you know, Bitcoin, Ether, uh, Solana and Cardano moved up strongly in the market as well as Polygon. You know, Polygon also exceedingly, exceedingly gone well in the market. It rose to almost 8.6% and uh, one, it was one of the you know is gainers in the top 10 cryptocurrency wise uh and also know that this polygon network posted strong adoption data showing it has now currently hosting around 53,000 decentralized apps on this polygon network so this is one of the tremendous achievements because no other network has these strong many apps uh you know unfolding in its own blockchain so these gains follow San Francisco Federal Reserve President Mary Daly, who indicating that the Fed, Federal Bank needs to start considering slow down its recent pace of interest hikes, saying at a talk at the University of California, Berkeley, that the Fed does not want to over tighten. So these kind of announcements literally made the market pull in green, but uh, the date did not end well for crypto because we are seeing again a uh, big drop in the market. And as we also posted in the early videos, we will surely expect, you know, Bitcoin to fall below the 12K mark and uh, there's one big support line. And once it touches, we are going to see a big boom by the later part of 2023.